I'm reporting on the north side of the Capitol building out here that remains on lockdown. There's a heavy fire and police presence out here. Talk to a state Capitol police sergeant who told me he could confirm little details at this time. But we do have confirmed from Springfield Police Chief Barry Helmrich that a woman was taken, is in custody after supposedly spilling some kind of unknown hazardous material across several areas of the second floor of the Capitol building reportedly around one this afternoon. Again, the Capitol building remains on lockdown. We're out here on the north side of the Capitol. And again, one woman is in custody. That is confirmed out here. A very large police presence. People that don't have any uh, scheduled business out here today are encouraged to stay away from the Capitol as police and fire investigate this active scene. Whatever material that woman spread, Police say, and the fire department says, excuse me, the fire department says that is currently being tested in a lab. Live on the north side of the Capitol, Joe Kadat, News Channel 20. We're out here reporting live on the north side of the Springfield State Capitol building. This area remains on lockdown, a heavy police and fire presence. We have confirmed that the Springfield Fire Chief, Barry Helmrichs, confirmed to us just moments ago that a woman is in custody. She's accused of spreading some kind of hazardous material across the second floor of the state capitol building around, around 1 this afternoon. You can see facing east there. This scene is very active. There are several streets closed in the area. If you do not have any scheduled business at the state capitol today, you're encouraged to stay away as police and fire continue to investigate this very active scene out here. There's hazardous materials crews out here monitoring things. I reached out to a sergeant with the state capitol police who tell me that they can't confirm much at this time. They've diverted any information with a state capitol police lieutenant. We are waiting right now to hear back from him. But again, what we can tell you is that the fire department confirmed with us that a woman is in custody. She's accused of spreading some kind of unknown hazardous material across the second floor at about one this afternoon. And we're told that that material is being analyzed right now. Live at the state capitol, Joe Kadat, News Channel 20. John, a very active investigation and a very active scene out here on the north lawn of the state capitol building. I'm going to step out of the way here so you can see hazardous materials crews were putting some kind of material in plastic bags, hosing each other off, hosing their hands off just moments ago. Uh, we do know that one woman is in custody. That's confirmed by the Springfield Fire Department uh, in connection with some kind of potentially hazardous material that was reportedly possibly spread along some areas of the second floor of the state capitol in the one o'clock hour this afternoon. Uh, heavy police, fire, capitol, state police presence on the north and east side of the capitol building right now. Hazardous material crews on the north side of the capitol lawn apparently uh, done apparently done putting whatever materials they were hosing off into some plastic bags. We were told by the Springfield Fire Department uh, just a few minutes ago that whatever material was recovered on the second floor is possibly being analyzed at a lab right now. If you don't have any uh, planned or needed business at the state capitol, you're encouraged to stay away from this active and very large police and fire scene out here. Again, hazmat crews, fire crews, police crews continue to investigate what was reported as possibly hazardous material spread along the second floor of the state capitol building in about the one o'clock hour. But what we do know is that some kind of material was removed from the building and was being sprayed off on the north side of the capitol long. We also have confirmed reports from Springfield Fire Department that a woman is in custody with possible connections to this very large scene unfolding and developing live out here. I'm Joe Kadat, News Channel 20.